Hi everyone, it's Tina from DeBoer's Auto. I wanted to make a quick video for you all uh, as part of a series celebrating women in the auto industry for March, which is Women's History Month. So today I wanted to talk to you about two great women in the automotive industry from the 1800s. One would be Alice Ramsey. She is a New Jersey native and she is credited with the first cross-country trip in an automobile in the United States. Building upon Bertha Benz, who did a first road trip ever in a vehicle years before, Alice Ramsey got her license and within the first year drove around New Jersey so much because she loved driving that she was the first one to put about 6,000 miles on a car within a year. Then she decided, I'm going to cross the country in this thing. And she did. She is credited with doing that first road trip and being able to show the versatility and use of an automobile. In addition to Alice Ramsey, let's not forget Miss June McCarroll. Miss June McCarroll is also an East Coast lady. She was born in the Adirondacks in upstate New York. She was originally trained as a physician and she also drove around often. One day while she was driving, she came around a turn and was face to face with another Ford truck, grill to grill, and she decided to make that split second choice to run up onto the shoulder to save lives. Since then, she had heard about some gentlemen in Michigan who had painted a line on a road, and she is credited with making this a standard practice nationwide. She made sure that there was compliance with every road and made sure to spread the news about how important it was to save lives by painting a center line and staying on the right side of the road going either way so that you didn't have collisions. For more information about women in the auto industry, not just these two ladies, but more, please stay tuned for our other parts of our series where we can celebrate all women in the auto industry from the early 1800s up until now. Thank you.